friends, my name is Haiti. I was a former camp activity leader back in 2016. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make these fun camp balloons as you rain sticks. Okay, so first things first is you are going to need your parents um, or guardian supervision and or permission. Okay, we're going to be working with some foil, a paper towel roll, a measuring spoon or a wooden spoon, a broomstick, some scissors and also paper and tape okay so what we're gonna do first is we're going to measure out 10 inch uh, pieces of foil and a 7 inch piece of foil okay I already pre-cut mine so mine are gonna look like this so are yours so it's gonna be one longer piece and then one shorter piece this one's the 10 inch and that one's the 7 inch okay so what you're gonna do, you're going to roll it long ways. So you're gonna roll one at a time, long ways. The seven inch is gonna look like this. And then the 10 inch is also gonna look like this. So they're gonna be sticks, okay? Place those to the side. So then you're gonna get your broomstick. So with the thicker piece, which is the 10 inch, you're going to wrap it around your broomstick, okay? And it's gonna make a spiral. So it's gonna look like that, okay? Then you're gonna set that aside. And then you're going to get your wooden spoon or your measuring spoon, and you're going to get your um, seven inch foil stick and also wrap that one around that wooden spoon or plastic spoon, okay? And it's gonna be a tighter spiral, so it's gonna look like that and you're just gonna slide it right off. Okay, set those both aside. You are gonna place the smaller spiral into the bigger one. Just like so. Place that to the side. And now you're gonna trace the base of your um, paper towel roll onto a piece of paper. I'm using computer paper, you can use notebook paper and construct or construction paper, okay? And you're just gonna trace, I used a marker, you can use a pencil or a pen, doesn't matter. You're gonna trace along the bottom, okay? I already pre-did this, so this is what it looks like. And you're gonna make two, one sm a bigger circle around that smaller circle, that way we can cut around it, that way it's easier to tape down onto our paper towel roll. Okay, and this is what I'm talking about. So you see those flaps? That's what we're gonna be cutting, okay? And you're gonna cut all the way until you hit that second line, that smaller line, okay? And once you do that, you're going to get your base. So you're going to place it face down so you're gonna have the uh, written part face down just like so. And then you're gonna get tape. Where's my tape? And you're going to tape all the way around just like this one is already, okay? And then you're gonna turn it over. You're gonna add your spirals. Again, they should be together. Okay. And then you're gonna get your rice. My rice is in a baggie. Again, it's one fourth cup of rice. You don't have to put it in a bag. You can put it kind of in a funnel. This kind of helps it uh, just with uh, cleaning up the mess or not making a mess actually. And you're gonna pour it in. Okay, once you do that, you're gonna do the same thing that you did on the bottom to the top, okay? Doesn't have to be perfect because um, you are going to cover it so nobody's going to see that tape. Okay. You're going to make sure all the way around. Just like that. Okay. Again. We're going to cover it again so it does not have to be perfect. Just make sure everything's secure because you don't want that rice to fall out. Okay. Back 
one more piece. Okay, so then you're gonna get another sh plain sheet of paper. You're gonna put, place it down. And then you're going to take, I use three pieces of tape. You can use more or you can use less depending on how you how secure you want it. I feel that tape, that three pieces is works just fine. Okay, and then you're gonna tape one at the top. Tape one in the middle. And then tape one at the end. Okay, and then you're gonna roll it and then tape it again, one, two, three. So it's gonna look like that, okay? So then now you get it decorated. Again, I decorated mine, saying Camper Ranzazu Rain Stick. I, did it, I drew a little sun and a little sunflower. You can get creative. You can maybe you know color the whole thing, or if you have construction paper, you don't even have to color it. And then just tilt it over and you should hear the rain. And then who knows, maybe you can make a little rain dance. And after you're done, make sure to post and upload any videos or pictures of your finished product. Let us know how you felt when you did this. I hope that um, it's a fun activity for you and your family to do together. Um, again, make sure to hashtag Camper Rantazoo when you're all finished uploading. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. Bye.